Welcome back to Let's Play Age of Wonders. Now, uh, you've already probably already seen the matches between Mal and I, the first and second one. The first one, I kind of died. <laughs> I uh, didn't do very well. I essentially got in a fight that I couldn't win, uh, and NPCs killed me, which was pretty embarrassing, but I will make up for that. Um, last time, what we did was... Um, Fire went death and let's do a little bit of air. Yeah. And um, the second game we did, I, we got into it and got went really well, but then Mal got jumped by NPCs also. So that was kind of embarrassing. But now we are going to do a tiebreaker. Yay! So again, I. Start off with a spellcaster. Uh, I got an undead knight, looks like an archer, and a swordsman. Now my, uh, I got. Let's see what spells do I have. Uh, personal, no, nope. global. Well, I have a spellcasting, um, which is spellcasting three off the bat, which is very good. I've got 15 skill points left over which means that uh, I will have plenty of time or uh, the next the first level I'll have spell casting four which will definitely give me a, a bit of a boost um, now undead they're they're all amazing like uh, they all have the basic troopers like have uh, cold protection death immunity fearless fire protection lightning protection all kinds of stuff like that they've got tons of pro oh, let's see okay first thing I'm gonna aim for is uh, um, Animate the dead. You go to magic, power distribution. I want it all under research. I want that spell quick. Let's see. I'm going to take my swordsman, send him there. I'm gonna send my archer here. Send my knight over here. And my knight, he's going to head back over here. Going to consolidate over here. Now, I want to get these towns. But I also want to send my hero over here because this is a death node, which has a couple little bad dudes on there. I uh, probably could do better. Uh, send better troops, I mean. Change. And we're going to make a whole bunch of archers because archers, undead archers, are amazing. Uh, they're not super great by themselves, but uh, they typically have some pretty good um, abilities. Now, Goblins, undead, and orcs like us, so we want we want to talk to them soon. And um, let's see what Mal's doing. Looks like he's got a hellhound, an archer, and a swordsman there, and he's going to send his entire army towards it. And he took it. Not surprising. So he's got that town for the first turn. We really need to take our town first turn. We've got. I don't think we're going to be able to get our, our other dudes there first turn. However, we will be able to get that node, and with my higher spell casting, we should be able to have a magic advantage. So. Now, in these earlier turns, I'm not going to stress out too much about pausing at anything. Oh, what? Oh, there's a nymph there. That guy is difficult to kill. Uh, let's see. Move the archer here. I don't think my guys are going to be able to kill that guy right away. I'm going to have to have a spellcaster there. And we got him. Great. Uh, let's see. The knight and my guy will have to move there soon. But if I remember correctly, there, yes, there's a gold and a mill there. Okay. Uh, he needs to come this way. And he can't move anymore. This town, we're going to enter. Hostile occupation force is strong. We're going to change that. We're going to migrate to undead. It's going to take three turns. 
We're producing an archer. Got some stuff there. Looks like everything's under control. Six turns for that, so. Alright, I'm going to pause it, and when it's my turn, I'll turn come back. Alright, here we go. We still want troops there. But we want this mine. And we want this crafts thing. So we can get a little bit more gold. We want that mana. Now... Let's see. Let's pile this troop here. So you've got two archers and two swordsmen. Not nothing too especially dangerous. The forces are still strong, so we'll leave those there. He's gonna come here. Now my caster, he is going to do something, which I, if that went away, I could do it. He's going to summon black spider. Not enough mana. Oh, it cost 35 out of my 30. 20, I mean. Let's see. Magic, power distribution. Let's gain a little bit of mana. Set. Magic. Cool. Now we want him to walk off one square. Let's check the forces. They're average. Okay. We want him to take that death node, which is going to take a turn. Because he's got to come down here. This death node will give us mana, which we need. So, actually, let's change our magic so that we get 20 mana. So that we can cast uh, the spider spell. Uh, it's going to take a turn. You guys are done. Alright, we we are set. Now let's see what we can do this turn. Got one more turn there. can send this veteran swordsman here. We want him to get that mana. He's going to come here. And he is going to cast Summon Spider. And then we'll take that death node next turn. Uh, still making archers. Let's make a few swordsmen. And yeah. Okay. Uh, we want, okay, they're not going to be, we need at least one more troop to take that city. We got that, we got those, we can ignore that, and, yeah, let's go back to magic, change power distribution back to normal, what it normally is. Let's, let's do two mana. And we're done. Okay, so our spell sh is cast. That's great. Uh, got a negative mana thing, so we need to change our magic. Now, the the upkeep for that spider is six mana, so we're going to set it like that. Set. And we're going to use this and attack here. Let's speed that up. And it looks like we didn't lose anybody. That's good. Now we have uh, this. Now we get 30 um, income from that. So we're going to use that. Head over here. And now my guy's magic. How much mana does he get? One of 30. Well, he can't really uh, cast anything right now. So we're going to leave him alone. This city just got tra transformed. So we're going to move these guys here. And attack that city. And we lost, it uh, looks like an archer and the swordsman. That's ours. And we're going to enter there. Queue up. Uh, not swordsman, I didn't mean to do that. Delete, delete, delete. Some archers. He's gonna move here. He should actually move all the way over here if he can. Change, we're gonna migrate to undead. We still got one more archer. There's making archers. Three archers there. Okay, so we're gonna have four archers, that's good. He's got a little bit more movement. We're going to move there, and then we're going to attempt to take that. So, we shall see what happens. Uh, we've got a few more turns for Animate Undead. Animate Dead, excuse me, so three turns. So, Animate Dead's going to be huge, and we'll see what happens. Alright, so I've decided to switch tactics up a little bit. What I need to do is actually send uh, some troops down to this corner, and center troops up to this corner because there are two cities that 
you know, are, are kind of split between. So I need to actually capture those. And to do that, it's going to take a little bit of doing, but we can do that easily enough. Uh, some archers, swordsmen. Uh, what's the queue in here? Three swordsmen. Let me change that. And add. Oops. Q Q. Q done. Exit. Uh, let me change Q to those. Exit. Enter there. After four archers, change. We're gonna Q one of those. Um, these guys are going to. I guess come with us, yeah. Just come on, come on, spiders. And um, that ten mana. Let's just change this so it's one turn. And yeah, I think we're done. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, this isn't good. I think I just got jumped. It appears that he went down the side, grabbed the villages that were friendly to him, got the troops out of there, and then chased my chased my guy down. And my guy is significantly weaker <laughs> than pretty much everything he's got. I mean, yeah, he's got hurl stones, so there's no way unless I can kill Mal somehow which he seems to have 10 hit points instead of a lot so if I can kill Mal somehow chain lightning is that, is that all I got? that's all I got <laughs> Welp. And then so dies. <laughs> uh, I died. That was exciting. <laughs> Yeah, see, winning. Armies. Yeah, he just he just jumped. Yeah, see, you can see exactly where he bought all those dudes. Mana. I kind of get some mana, but I spent it. And he suddenly shot up in mana. I wonder where he got the mana from. I guess he got a random hold. Same amount of heroes. A little bit more structures. Yeah.